10,000 kilometers from the prison in Virginia where Maria Butina has been jailed since last June. In the frigid city of Barnaul in western Siberia, her parents and sister gather at the family home. Here, no one doubts Maria's innocence. Her father, like others, believes she was just trying to build ties with Americans. We find that quite unnatural to accuse a person because of her willingness to see the relations between the two countries as good ones, more friendly. That would be correct, taking into account not quite good relations that presently exist between our countries. Maria has always been willing to see relations of our two countries as friendly ones. The legal bills are adding up, and the family is having trouble. The political support that they appear to be getting from the Kremlin, they say, does not come with financial help. My family was quite alarmed by these events, and presently we regularly appeal to the mass media with the request to help us, since the legal support on behalf of the American side, I mean the lawyers, is quite expensive. Putina studied in this city, and it was here that she launched her political career at the School of Real Politics that trains young people on how to lobby local politicians. U.S. persecutors say they have evidence showing Maria Butina had contact with Russian intelligence officials. But to Humanta and to Russian public opinion, Maria Butina is a victim of Washington's domestic battles. I do not think this is an issue of Russia and America. From my perspective, getting deeper into the real politics, this is an internal American issue. In other words, Trump, to put it this way, his entourage and the Democrats. In Moscow, Butina's case is portrayed as yet more aggression from the West against Russia. In Barnaul, the tensions between Moscow and Washington have Maria Butina's family in limbo. They can only hope to have their daughter home soon. We so much look forward to it. I do not even know how this first moment will be. We shall certainly embrace each other and probably will cry a bit. But that will be tears of joy, that is for sure. Maria Butina has pleaded guilty to one charge of conspiracy to influence American politics, and her sentence, like the deportation, is pending. The battle that her case has unleashed between Moscow and Washington has sent a chill through some in this frigid and faraway Siberian city. For Ricardo Marquino in Barnaul, Russia, Igor Tikhanenka, VOA News.